coming, we learn languages in the classroom, but uh, we really believe that Jesus' command to love your neighbour as yourself is very important for us. So what better way to love your neighbour than to learn what your neighbour likes to eat and what makes them tick yeah. by actually going to their country. Not just as a tourist, but uh, as someone that's invited into their home. Beautiful. Someone that's invited into their school. And by learning to love our neighbour, uh, then that's really fulfilling Jesus' command to love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, mind and strength. Mm. Um, this trip really helped me open my eyes to Japan and their culture. Yeah. Um, it's the most polite culture I've ever been to. 0.5% um, of Christians. Speaking from a student's perspective, what was something powerful that you learned or something you'd like to share with people now that you're back? Yeah. Well, the one thing I took from it was the opportunity to be able to be exposed to the language constantly, like yeah. all day, all night. Um, like we went to the school, we had a homestay, so basically all aspects, which really helped me develop my confidence in speaking, but also like my accent and uh, learn so many new words. Yeah, great. <laughs> <Right. laughs> so if you were speaking to future students, what might be a reason why that you would say to them, hey, if you want to learn this or you want to do this, this is why you'd go if they had an opportunity. Yeah. So it's like a great bonding experience, especially because year tens, year elevens, and year twelves went there. So I got to build like really strong connections with like people from other year groups, and I think that's really great and important. Um, yeah. So like we built like our own community, and now like we're close friends.